Arsenal win 1 0 against Shakhtar. Aston Villa win 2 0 against Bologna, flying high to the top of the Champions League table with nine points. Unbelievable. John Duran scores again, and he gets dragged. He wasn't happy, but. Big, big things happening at Villa Park. Uh, Aston Villa fans are buzzing. 03 717 Let's go to Dane. He's an Arsenal fan. All right, Dane? Hello, mate. All right, Dane. Dane, there's a lot of heat coming uh, Arteta's way at the moment. Do you think it's a bit harsh? Yeah, of course it is. It's rubbish. I want to swear, but... I, I, don't, I, don't swear, Dane. Like, don't Dane. swear, Dane. Dane, don't do That's that, I mean, but you know don't what it swear. is? You know what it is? These are the same fans, yeah? That'd be screaming Wenger out before. Then they were screaming Emery out. They was they was they're the same. They're the same fans. They want to pin a blame. We won a game. We've just played the midweek with ten men. We're going to be shattered. We've then come out. I didn't even want him to play that team. I'd rather I'd rather play kids. And then some other caller a minute ago, that James kid, he's talking about oh we let out Reese Nelson. Reese Nelson's on a loan, mate. He's on a loan. Yeah, I, I don't think they're good. Kid. Look, personally. You know, you let them players go because they're not good enough for Arsenal to get exactly. to the next level. They're trying to get to Man City's level, right? They've got to go over that threshold of, of being better than them. Reese exactly. Nelson and Ketia, Smith Rowe. And Ketia was nowhere near, nowhere near good enough. No. Nowhere near good enough to no, play for Arsenal. He weren't. He right? weren't. So, From the start. That, but you do look a bit light, though, no, Dane. Enough. You do look a bit light. We look terrible. We look like we're knackered. Mm. But that don't mean scream our tetter out. No. Do you know what I mean? No, like, like, even if, even look, even if we look, even if we finish in Europa placings this year, I don't scream our tetter out. No manager has ever done like four seasons in a row like get better points. It's never happened. But what about <laughs> so, the, what about you know what the mean? squad, Dane? Dane, the, the, the squad itself, it yeah. is looking as, and I made this point earlier when you heard it that in areas where you can really hurt teams, your your best player for me, and one of the most consistent number ten in the, in the league in the last three years, has been Odegaard. Right? Yeah, and definitely. that's across every... You're going to miss that player, but you... Who who plays there now? Who is that man? I, Who's the know, one you know, bounce you know, the balls off? Who's the one that, that you see, either Party or Rice, bounce that ball in on the edge of the that, box? On, on, that pitch, on that pitch today, there was no one. Mm. There was no one at all. So you, you know, I, believe, I believe that he should be playing... Ethan Nawari in that position right yeah, now. I th- do you know what? I, I think that's a great shout, you know. I think he might you know, have to think about that. Just throw him in I and let him see, what, see what he can do. Because whenever I... Look, I know he's young. He's boy, yeah. you know, but then when you get fans like this calling up, mm. saying, I'll tear out, I'll tear out, the pressure that puts then on him, he can't. if he goes and plays that kid, then we lose, then what? So no, I do you know what? I think, I think he needs that little ball player. On the edge of that box in that ten position. Hopefully, w- hopefully, Odegaard. If we go and play like that, like tonight that we did against Liverpool, we'll get battered. You will, yeah. Simple, you know. But um, we need to. If Odegaard's back and yeah. Timber's back, the other guy as well. He, he was saying, "Oh, the only player that we've had out all years in Schenker. That's rubbish as well. Last season we had Timber. Timber played one game. Mm. So, When's he back, Timbo? Did he pick up another injury? And come, come, come late injured again. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's a bad start. Yeah, injury. He only played one game last season for Arsenal. Yeah. Like um, in well, the first when, team. Do we know when Odegaard's going to be back? How far away is he? He's from... in training. They said that he's in training. So. Yeah. So I think he's had to today. adapt. To I think Arteta's adapt. You know, like he, he, yeah. he's realised. Right, I've got another couple of weeks without my main man, Odegaard. Can I? Can I? Can I stay in touch in distance? You know, can I get through the games? You know, he had a sending well, you know, off. You know Discipline's not well. been great, but... Well, yeah. Do you know what as well? If, can you remember last season, going into December, all my mates were like, yeah, you bottled it, you bottled it, this and that. You did. You're done. And then it didn't 2024 come. We didn't lose a game until this weekend. That's right, yeah. yeah. Do you know what I mean? So when you look at it like that, I'm like, it's, it's, you can't, you, it's October. I thought, we, we, we can't say anyone's lost the league in October. Do you know, mm. Chelsea, for me, for me, I said this in the group chat, yeah? What group chat? Chelsea, what group chat are you in? Chelsea. Who are you with? Well, well, all, all my mates, all my mates. Go on, who do they support? Give us, give us some Chris, of the names Chris in the group chat. Oh, we've got us, everyone in there. Go on, we've give us some of the names, some of the boys. All the lads, uh, Oli, Ben, yeah. Rich. Rich. Yeah. Got all the lads. All, the all, the lads, all sorts right. going on oh, in that group yeah, chat. I bet, there. I bet there's all sorts yeah, of... Yeah. yeah. You don't want that, you you know, don't want that, you know, <laughs> that WhatsApp group going public. You see, Chelsea, Chelsea still could... Still could challenge for that title. We can't. We can't. Let me tell you. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Champions League. Any team that's in the Champions League this year is going to start feeling the effects. Just like Arsenal are now. Villa, right? It's, it's, you've got to play eight extra games. Come December, we're going to be effed. So many teams that are in the Champions League, they're going to be effed. Yeah. 
Yeah. Is that going in the group chat? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Dainey boy, oh, top man. Dane, Dane, oh, hold, hold on, Dane, he's still there. Oh, he's gone because he, sorry, he's, mate, he said sorry, he'll, I'd, I'd well, him. No, you cut him off. I didn't mean to cut him off. Who's in charge here? I'm sorry, mate. He looked like a roll, said, yeah. He was dropping. You're scrappy, dude. Right. Yeah, I, I'm Scooby. Let me at him. Let me at him. <laughs> Just pipe that. Sit down, yeah. Just pipe that. <laughs> uh, let's go to Jamal. Uh, before we do that, though, uh, Aston Villa boss Unai Emery has been speaking after their 2 0 win over Bologna tonight. He was asked about John Duran's reaction to being subbed. Of course, uh, uh, I, I am managing everything and, and the reaction of the players as well. Uh, everything uh, we are sending the message in the, in, the, in the dressing room respect our values to be mature and responsible. Sometimes someone, because it's not only John Duran, before as well, some players sometimes they are reacting a little bit. It's, it's under, under our control or under my, con- under my control, and of course, it's not irrelevant. Mm. I mean, he knows what he's doing, mate. He knows he what he's be, doing. It won't be the first time he's had someone kick off because they've been taken off, mate. It just happened that he scored, and the first thing that he does, he takes <laughs> him off. Takes what? him off. <clears throat> but the, the timing for John Duran was absolutely lousy. Yeah. Because. Because Ollie Watkins was stripped. The decision was made. The fact that he gets the goal, yeah. he's not going to change his mind. In fact, in some ways, you can say it strengthens that decision. Yeah, job we, done. We got the goal. Yeah. Now you can come off and eat arrest players. Yeah. So he was looking for that second goal. You've got it. Thank you very much. And all of a sudden, he starts firing his little... Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you're used to doing that. Scoring OG, get dragged. Mate. Yeah. Mate, Come I, off, making I, a moan up. I, I scored a few, mate. Cundy's off again. I, I scored a few. He's scored, had a stink. I scored a few. <laughs> scored a few, mate. Get, but you know, you can't... He'll learn. Duran will learn, mate. Yeah, he's he'll young. Learn. Come on. Doesn't feel like young, though, does he, when he plays? No. You know, he's a and, young lad, but he looks like a monster. Well, he's a, he's a unit, and he, he plays like a man. But the truth is, and you saw that reaction, that's the reaction of a young kid, isn't it? Yes. I don't know. No player likes to come off. I mean, you know, Matt Madison's done it, you know? No, but you don't... I don't know whether he's done that. Punching and kicking. You mm. know, he, he, there's an immaturity about that. Yeah. He'll learn. Mm. All right, let's go to Jamal. He's a, a Villa fan. All right, Jamal. Hi, Jamal. Hi, boys. How are you? I'm all right, mate. You been at the game? Yeah, I've been at the game. Just uh, literally just got back, just parked up. I think it was a fantastic game. Um, it's a, a great feeling to be a Villa fan at the moment. I mean, yeah. turning up to games and actually expecting your team to win like feeling like your team's going to win and I think that's all thanks to Uni, Uni Emery yeah. I think when you look at the managers that are in the Champions League at the moment um, behind Ancelotti and Pep I would probably say Unai Emery's the next best oh, it's a um, big call that one in the Premier League I mean uh, g- give me another manager it's Ancelotti what? sorry? After what in the Ancelotti, world? after Ancelotti and Pep oh, who's uh, the next best manager well, in Europe uh, Okay, what about Jamal. Alonso? J- Jamal, I, I, J- look, Alonso? look, Jamal, right? You guys are doing very well. This is, this is what I love, football fans, right? Mm-hmm. We're all the same, right? We're all the same. I know he's doing a great job. He ain't won nothing yet, yeah. right? And when he wins I mean, something, in- when he wins something, he's fa- listen, can yeah. I just remind you, you failed in uh, Europe last year. Yeah, we failed in Europe right. last year. Okay. But right. In Europe, what's his record? He's right. got four. Yeah, no, but he ain't done it at Villa. Titles. Fine, fine. But yeah, what I'm saying is. He's not done it at Villa, but when you look at success within Europe, <laughs> all right? When you look at his success in <laughs> Europe, amazing. and you look at managers Klopp? in Europe. Where does, where does Klopp fit into this? Or you've forgotten about Klopp's him? Klopp's retired. I One know. Champions League. It's... One Champions League. <laughs> what, you'd rather have you'd rather have Unai Emery over Jurgen Klopp? What about Tuchel? What about Thomas Tuchel? I've said currently. He is the third best Euro- uh, manager in Europe currently. No, oh, Jamal, honestly, mate, think, you don't need to come out and say team, that. Enjoy it. Lucky, any team would be lucky to have you and I, Emery. No, 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 don't doubt that, Jamal. I mean, come listen, on, mate. Far wrong. No, no, but you can't. And the, I think, when and you, I, I think go on, go on. Go on. Okay, go on. I think. On. Let, all right, then go let's on. let's agree to disagree go there. On. But on. let's look at tonight and what's happened. I think it's absolutely disgraceful after a game where Villa have beaten Bologna, Unai Emery has to come out and answer questions about a young lad who's 20, who's still developing, and his attitude. I think in the summer, you can have a look. He was throwing up the iron signs um, because he wanted to force a move to West Ham. Yes, he's he's in great form at the minute, but when you've got the likes of Ollie Watkins 
um, who has been absolutely brilliant for Villa um, all the way through the Premier League, uh, over the years in the Premier League. Mm. You've got to bide your time as a 20-year-old, wait for your opportunities. He's taking his opportunities that he's getting. But John Duran, when he starts a game, is the, a completely different player to one that comes on from the bench. He started this season against Wickham. And I've mentioned this previously on TalkSport. Started against Wickham. He'd done absolutely nothing in that game. He had three opportunities in the first 20, 30 minutes of that game. One-on-ones with the keepers. Put them wide. He scored a penalty in the last few minutes. He's got to bide his time, learn and develop, and stop making Unai Emery have to answer questions about his behaviour. Jamal, he's only a kid. I I I know he's a kid. How old are you, Jamal? I'm 33, mate. You're 33. What was little Jamal doing at 20? What were you doing at 20? Oh, mate, I was playing football and fighting. <laughs> <laughs> but, but never, I never, once, I never <laughs> once reacted like that but when I managed to What do you mean? You, you mean? just you said, said you're fighting. fighting. You said you're scrapping. Get on with it. Oh, I mean, I'm mean fighting with opposition players. Well, there you go, then. Jamal, honestly. If you, could, you know, he's a young I, lad. I, 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 Kundi J, I, I'm only five foot seven, mate. They used to pick on me because I used to play centre half. I was yeah. too short. They, yeah. they were treading on my toes, throwing elbows. Scrappy do you, you aren't you, Jamal? You are a little scrappy. A little do. scrappy do. He, he's an international player. He I know, but he's only twenty, Jamal. Maturing. He's got to start behaving and maturing, though. You can't have you and I, Emery, who's done what he's done at the Villa, come out <laughs> after a game where he should be praising the rest Jamal. of the Villa squad. To answer questions about his I know, behavior. but Jamal, well, imagine if, right? Imagine if yeah. you had your, your, it's one of your, mem- your family members, right? On the side of the yeah. pitch, right? Yeah. And Jamal, a little five foot seven centre half, right? And yeah. he starts fighting with the opposition and, you know, comes away with a cut lip and he gets sent off, right? What are you going to say to your mum and dad? They say, they have a, come, Jamal, come here, all right? We'll have a word with you, all right? Yeah. What are you doing? Oh, what are you doing? My dad would have given me a clip around the ear, Jay. Right. But that's, but that's all he's doing. He's just the same age as you were, Jamal. Well, I hope Unai gives him a clip around the ear. <laughs> well, he might do. <laughs> he might do. <laughs> the Sports Bar with Jamie O'Hara and Jason Cundy. Monday to Thursday nights from 10 on AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.